These two exercises are toe flexion strengthening. Now toe flexion strengthening is important because it helps to stabilize the foot and give us a good stable base to work off for the rest of our body. Now we're going to do the big toe separate to the outer four toes and this is simply because they're actually controlled by two separate muscles and your big toe is always going to be a lot stronger than your outer four toes. So all you need for this is a band. I've got a looped band here today. The preference would actually be for a long flat TheraBand and I'll explain to you why in a second. Now the big toe is super simple. You just simply loop your band around like so keeping the ball of the foot and the heel on the floor. You bring the big toe up, put some tension into the band, and then push down to the floor. Hold for a couple of seconds, and then really importantly, you control this back up. You're not just letting the band pull you up, okay? As you'll see there, the other four toes will come off. That's absolutely fine. So once again, push down, hold, and then come back up. Now I'll switch around here so you can see my outer four toes for the next bit. Now you can certainly use your looped band for this. You just loop them, loop it over the outside four toes, again keeping the heel and the ball of the foot on the ground. You bring your toes up and then push back down against the band resistance and then come back up again. Now what you can see here is the downfall of using the looped band. Unfortunately, the angle of the outer four toes often mean this slips up with um, the second, third toe often being a lot longer than the outside toe. To counteract this, you use a long, thin band. Unfortunately, I don't have one today, but the traditional TheraBand that's about 10 or 12 centimeters wide, you put that under your heel and pin it down and then bring it up over the toes like so. Now you can see here, unfortunately, my band is too thin to cover all four toes, but your traditional TheraBand will cover all four toes. And you simply go through the same action of pushing down, holding, and then coming back up. Now, what you need to be careful of with the outer four toes is that they don't curl like so. You want the toes to stay straight and you're straight hinging down, pushing through the tips of the toes there like so. That is your toe flexion strengthening exercises.